Hello and what's up YouTube? Today's video is just a short update on Enphase Energy, Peloton, and DQ. Plus, I'm going to show you the hot stock list from a week ago and how those stocks are performing. For my shared online portfolio, we had $100,000 yesterday, which is a huge accomplishment since that portfolio was started less than four months ago at $66,000. It's on fire, but we'll talk more about that in another video. Now's the time to grab a cup of coffee and hang on because this is not your normal stock channel. What we're looking at right now are two of the hot stocks lists that I published last Monday on December 14th. And the first one is my fundamental watch list, and that'll have a PE ratio typically between one and 100. One slipped in here at 102.9. And the second one is my technical watch list, where these will be all others with a PE of above 100 or negative. And what I want to draw your attention to are the three stocks we're covering today. We've got DQ, Peloton, and Enphase Energy. And what we have on the right is part of the Beast Mode scorecard, and I wanted to compare how they've done over the last week. And the first thing we can notice is the price. So on our top one here, LOB, which is a bank, the price last week on the 14th was $45.48 when I published the hot stocks. On that day, it was up $1.62. The percent change on the day was $3.69. The PE ratio is 50.53, and this is the percent change, and this is how much it was up over the last 90 days. Then if we move over to this side, we can see the price on the 14th was 45.48, and that matches up here, but the price yesterday was $50.16, and the return over one week has been 4.87%. Now the first thing we notice on all of these stocks is check out the returns. Every one of them, all nine is positive. Our biggest winner is Peloton at 13%, and this doesn't include the big news that hit yesterday yesterday after hours. They're uh, buying another company and they should be up another 10% today. So that's a winner, winner, chicken dinner, home run stock right there, Peloton. And let's go through each of these. We've got LOB, DQ, Peloton, SKYY, FDN, Enphase Energy, ENPH, TWLO, 59, and Datadog, ticker DDOG. And then just check it out on the right hand side. You can see the actual numbers. And I mean, this just simply blows me away because these are the first two watch lists that I publish most days during the week. And we hit on nine out of nine, which is phenomenal. And I'm going to cover those on the scorecards in just a minute. Let's take a quick look at the Beast Mode scorecards on a few of these stocks. We're now looking at the Beast Mode scorecard on these three stocks. On the left, we've got Peloton in the middle, Dowco New Energy, and on the right, we've got Enphase Energy. And again, these stocks were on the hot list last Monday, the 14th, and because of that, I bought Peloton and Enphase Energy, and this is just simply how it works, so I'm just sharing you the system and what we do. Now, if we look at Peloton, ticker PTON, we can see the 52-week price range is $18 to $145. Their PE ratio is 889. The year-to-date stock gain is 408%. You can see the return over one one week, one month, three months, and one year. It's absolutely impressive. And what I really like on this one is the revenue growth in the last year is 128.5%. When I'm buying a high growth stock, I'm looking for revenue growth, and that would be any stock with a PE ratio over 100, which this one qualifies for. And then we've got our net income margin. It's 2%. That's a little on the skinny side, but again, it's a high PE company, and that net margin is going to get bigger as that PE number comes down. And then we've got the levered free cash flow at 24.5%, and that's a really really nice, impressive number for them. That means they've got plenty of cash to run their normal business off of what's just coming in from their regular revenue right now. So definitely a great number for them. Let's jump on over to DQ. We can see their 52-week price range is $8 to $64. Their PE ratio is lower at 55.5, and their year-to-date stock gain is absolutely impressive at 498%, and their revenue growth last year was 78.3%. One thing I like when we compare side-by-side -side is the revenue growth is 78.3%, and it looks small compared to Peloton's 128.5%, but when we realize their PE ratio is so much lower at 55.5, then that tells us that this revenue growth is impressive for a lower PE company. I mean, that is very strong and that's something that gets me excited. Then we've got the operating margin is 21.9%, which is very strong. Their net income margin is 14%. The S&P 500 average is just over 10%, so they're doing even better than the S&P 500 stocks. And their leverage free cash flow is negative 23.5%, so that's a a little bit of a red flag here. That's nothing that would stop me. But again, we're looking at the entire big picture. So one problem with the levered free cash flow is something that we can overlook if we like everything else. And then the third stock is one of my favorites. It's Enphase Energy, ticker ENPH. And I've been in this stock for some time, have multiple positions on it. And I just loaded up on it again last week. The 52-week price range is $21 to $172. So it's trading right near those all-time highs. The PE ratio
ratio is 121.4, so it's almost what I would call a fundamental stock. Their year-to-date stock gain is 554%. The revenue growth in the last year is 42.1%, and that's a number that I definitely like to see, so very good. Not quite as strong as our other ones, but still good. And then we've got a net income margin that's very nice at 24.7%, and their levered free cash flow is very strong at 29.9%, and that's our three top scorecards from today. You've just seen my hot stock list from last week and these picks are nine for nine with all of them being profitable. I wasn't even planning on doing a video today, but when I saw these numbers, I wanted to share them with everyone because these stocks are still hot and running. I'm gonna close with some of the hundreds of success stories we receive from people just like you. It's surreal to see these types of results and I hope you stick around to the very end. Thanks so much and I'll see you on the next video.